Guys, drop everything. Jason Blug, owner of Bloghouse, has finally released the Five Nights at FNAF movie trailer. And I'm gonna watch and react to it on my second channel because I can do what I want over it. I'm not chained down by the limits of my main channel anymore. I might make a food review. Who knows? But seriously, I'm actually really excited for this trailer and I thought, because you know, it's a topic that I've made many videos on. Why not react to it, you know? Why not? Let's go. FNAF movie trailer. Welcome to Freddy's It's Analog Horror. I told you. I told you they do Analog Horror. I'm telling you. Oh, they're jamming! Never mind, they're dead. You got this whole VHS section here. They've got like the, the Premiere Pro VHS filter that every Analog Horror FNAF VHS video maker uses. There's, there's good old Josh. They look so good! Okay, I don't understand how people could say that these animatronics don't look perfect. They look perfect. This is exactly what they'd look like if they were real. Then you've got my guy, my guy Josh, I think that's his name. I think he works perfectly as, I mean, I'm assuming it's Mike. No offense to the guy, I'm, he's a great actor, but he pulls off the default look very well. Like he, he's very default. He can play the default character, you know? He's like, when you first make a me, the default me, he, he's the default me. Which I think works very well for this movie, so it's not a bad thing, it's a really good thing. I'm so excited. Hello? That looks so cool. We're He's there. So much fun together. Oh my god. <laughs> Torture. There's a better look at Bonnie. Um, you can see he's got his classic marshmallow teeth. And of course you've got the office, you've got all the, the monitors. Um, oh, and they've even got the, the FNAF 1 Celebrate poster. That's so cool. That's so cool. You can tell that they knew what they were doing. Like, this isn't just some horror movie that's loosely based around the FNAF franchise, because, like, this is, like, an exact view of one of the monitors in the actual game. <laughs> and here you've got Freddy just kind of, like, looking. He's just chilling. Then you've got, like, this weird torture scene. I don't... I don't really understand what this part is. Oh my god. This is like Saw. He's like, I'm assuming this is like being put into the animatronic. Um, I'm assuming he's not actually going to die from this. He's going to like get out somehow. Oh, the Shaggy. You've got some children kind of standing. I'm assuming these are like the spirits of children. These aren't just actual children just standing here and they run away. This guy's got a funky hat. That's a funky hat. This kid's funky. And here you've got the man. The myth. Shaggy. I mean, this is just perfect casting. Like, this, that is William Afton. That is a perfect representation of William Afton. Um, I'm still not sure what role he's going to play in this movie, because obviously, you know, he's just a guy here. He's not, like, been spring-locked or anything. And considering this is, like, my favourite character in the entire franchise, I hope they do a lot with him. I hope there's not just, like, a couple of scenes. I hope he's, like, the actual main villain of the film, and the main villain isn't just, like the animatronics and them being like scary and whatever and you know, bah. <laughs> Here is some guy getting a little bit scared. He's doing the YouTuber thumbnail face. <laughs> oh my God. Into the, into the pit. That's a thing, right? Holy shit. He's pissed. Oh my God. He is pissed. <laughs> Why are his eyes red? Is that is that a thing? Hey guys, Freddy, Freddy's off the perk. He's, he's, he's off the perk. And Bonnie, oh my god, they're all just zooted. They're all just zooted the entire film. Weed Bonnie. Okay, so that was actually pretty good. I'm not really sure how I feel about the red eyes, to be honest. Um, I think it looks kind of goofy. I think it would look better if it was just, you know, white eyes or just normal eyes or maybe even like no eyes. The red is kind of like, it's very goofy, but like this this film is going to be goofy. It's a FNAF movie. FNAF is goofy. And you know, it's a kids franchise. Like I know a lot of people are like, oh, I want this to be like R-rated and be gruesome and gory and horrible, but it is it is a kids franchise. Like, so many children are obsessed with this game, so it's gonna be catered to them somehow. But it's not gonna be a kids film, it's just gonna be a film that's okay for kids. This looks a bit better when it's like darker and just the red eyes, um, but this looks kinda weird, in my opinion. And here's the logo for the film, I guess. Um, it looks pretty good, I like the colours, it's different, it's not like, it's not exactly like the original FNAF logo, but I mean, that was just like, a font, that was like, hacked font, so. This is good. This works.